Hello, we're here to teach you how to walk through a ladder today, doing ladder work on our intermediate tricks list. This is Scamoli. He knows how to do the ladder, but we'll try to teach it from the beginning through the end so you can see all the stages of how this would work. Um, first thing you want to do is, if your dog is at all afraid of the ladder, um, you can turn it upside down. Oops. So it's a little bit lower, and if, or if you have a small dog, you turn it upside down so it's not so high for them. If you have a bigger dog like this and they're not at all concerned about walking through things, there you go, then you can turn it back the normal way. But we'll set it up like this for him. And we're going to get started. I'm going to get some treats. And we'll show you the beginning steps of walking through a ladder. Good boy. There you go. Could use if your dog tends to step out the side, having boards on the side could help keep their feet in there. So, say. So, our first step for a dog who is a little bit nervous of this uh, might be just to lure him through. So, I'm going to turn my back here for a second so you get a really great view. Um, but it's just about getting your dog to walk through, click him every step forward. And I know he's not really in there, it's hard for me to see what he's doing. Good boy. What you want is you want a foot in each rung, just like that. <laughs> and he jumped at the end, so that's not really exactly what I want, but you do want him to walk through. This ladder is a little bit narrow for him. He would actually do better with a little bit wider. Here, you want to try it first and just show us how it's done. Show how it's done the right way without playing around. Let's try it first. Go, walk it. Good boy. So that's what it's supposed to look like. Ready? Walk it. Walk it. There, he was cheating that one, so he gets nothing for that. Walk it. Good boy. He kind of skipped on the end there, okay? Walk it. <laughs> that's cheating. Turn around. Walk it. Good boy. There you go. So the first step. If you have a, a scared dog, we'll, we'll do it this way, then I don't have to turn my back to you guys. Sit there. So the first step is straddle the ladder if you need to, and you're just going to, if your dog's at all nervous, you're just going to click a treat, and you can put the treat on the ground. That helps keep them moving. Now he's getting there. So a more advanced trick would be teaching him to walk on the rungs, which is what he's trying to do right there. Why not? And you're really just getting them to acclimate to the ladder at this point. Oh boy. The last treat you want to put far enough out that your dog can get all the way through it. That's almost too hard for him <laughs> to do because he's done it um, the right way so far. So once you get that, and, and actually then you can take a treat and put it there in each rung. Good oh boy. And as your dog moves forward through it, That sort of forces them to take a step in each rung versus running and jumping over the rungs. We don't want them jumping over the rungs. We just want them to walk through. Walk it. Good boy. So we'll do that one more time. I'm going to have him sit. Wait. 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 And I'm going to load it up first. So there's a treat in each one. If your dog has a nice weight, you could do it this way. Wait. He may go too fast, so we'll see. Walk. And of course, the treat, the click, is marking each step, and he's getting the treat. I'm, I don't have to treat again. He's getting the next treat. That's his, that's his treat after the click. We'll do that one more time. Sit. Wait. Now I'm going to skip a rung and do every other. One, because he's learning it, and two, bec ah. <laughs> and because he's stealing the treats, and because I was out of treats. He's <laughs> trying to be economical, and it didn't work. All right, let's try that again. Sit. Wait. Oh, wait. You're supposed to be a role model. You're being annoying. Wait. Wait there. Wait. 
wait, sit, wait. Get them lined up, especially if you're using a narrow ladder like this, so that they can't walk around the side of it. Walk it. Good boy. There you go. There's one back here. You missed it. Go find it. So eventually, you get them to do that, and then you don't have to bend over anymore once they got that far, and then. You can actually lure them with a treat, so I'm going to put a treat in my right hand since we're going in that direction, and we'll just do walk it. Good boy, and give a treat at the end. We'll go one more time. Come on this way. Ready? Walk it. Oh, so he stepped out, so I'm not going to give him one. Walk it. Good boy, but you want to keep your hand low so they're not looking up, and that that'll if they're looking up, they're going to spin their butt out, and it's going to cause them to. Um, step out the side, which you saw he did there that one time. Ready? Walk it. Good boy. Yeah, he was walking on the outside. Walk it. Good boy. I think that was right. I can't see what he's doing on his upside. Walk it. Good boy. Eventually, you get to the point where you can just walk alongside him and say, walk it or whatever your ladder, whatever your word's going to be. Come here. Sit. And then you can start to send him. So we're going to try that. Go, walk it. Go. Good boy. And toss him the treat out there. Walk it. Good boy. So it takes a little practice. It takes a little work to build up to that step. But walk it. Good boy. That was a nice slow walk. You do want a slow walk. You want them to have to step their feet over each rung. Not a bunny hop. Um, it's just better muscle muscle control for them and better conditioning. Walk it. Good boy. Good boy. You want them to learn to pick up their feet independently. Go. Walk it. Go. That's cheating. Walk it. Good boy. Try once more. Walk it. Walk it. Good boy. And let's come back. Ready? Back up. Walk it. Good boy. Now we can do the ladder backwards at some point, and um, they'll learn to use their back feet. And that will be an expert trick or something, I think. I think backing up is advanced, so backing up through a ladder might be um, not on the list, but it might be a made-up expert trick that we can do, right? Oh, he's backing up. <laughs> Good. Sit. Good boy. Down. Wait there. Watch me. Are you all done? Are you all done? There you go. Good boy. That's your ladder.